Hello everyone, I am Alex Pavalsik from HowToDoTech.com and today I'm going to be looking at getting rid of some of the pre-installed apps in Windows 8. So Windows 8 is really nice that it comes with some pre-installed apps that can be very helpful such as the Internet Explorer and the music playing app, uh, photos app I found very helpful. However, some of these apps I found to be more of a bother than a help such as the video app and people messaging they just haven't really worked for me and getting rid of them is not that hard however there is something you might want to look out for not every single app that comes pre-installed with Windows 8 is available in the Microsoft Store I don't know why it's kind of a fluke they have such as Internet Explorer so if you were to uninstall Internet Explorer 10 you might have some troubles getting it back so that's just something you might want to look at. I'm going to be uninstalling the video app just for a preview and I have checked the store. It is available for re-download. So to uninstall any app that comes with Windows 8 is actually not that bad and it's a lot like installing any other app. Just right click on it and you can hit uninstall. Once there you can say uninstall and it's going to install in the background like any app before. Now as I said before this might not be available for re-download for me exactly it is and then this will also change some defaults by default the photos app is the app that will open any photos that you have on your computer by default the music app opens music and video app opens video now i have the media player for windows downloaded already on this pc so i don't have to worry about any defaults being changed there if I were to uninstall, say, the Photos app, I want to make sure I have something else that can open Photos. Again, since these are defaults by Microsoft, they expect you to be using these instead of other apps, so they are by default set as your default. So I really hope you have enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel for more videos like it. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. You can also email us at howtodotechyt at gmail.com. Feel free to also give us suggestions for future videos and check out howtodotech.com for more videos like this one. Now you can click on one of the four topics on your screen to go to one of our playlists. So I am Alex Bavalsik and I will see you next time.